Hey, we, we've got the whole wall clad in our side here. Uh, Point nine. Okay, uh, let's get out of There's something trying to spin here. up over there. There's something trying to spin up right over there. I, and uh, I guess it's right over the cell. Val's right here. Right. And the right, see that right there? See that? There's a tornado on the ground, David. Tornado on the ground. Quick, quick spin up. Quick spin up. It, it's going to be on the on the east side of the wall cloud. This is going to be on the southeast side of the cell. Uh, it, it's lifted now. Uh, it was a very, very quick spin up. Uh, probably right out of town. Oh, still uh, see, it's still on the ground. Okay, it's still it's there. Time. It's still there. We see a little bit of debris and a little bit of cloud debris being picked up right there. Right here. And this is right in the river area, David. Right in there the river is. area. Right here. Okay, there it is. There it is now. There's one going to see. Oh, there over there. there. Over there's another tornado on the ground, David. Right. Look, right ahead of us. Right in our shot. Okay. Right, right in our shot. Okay, Hang that. On, just a second here. Okay, this is this is a this is a bigger rotation right here. Okay, here we go. Is this uh, the Valley? Yeah. Okay, Val, hang on a second. Hey, Val. Valley, 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 Valley. Valley. Over Highway 74. Okay, we had another wow. spin up. We had another spin up about a half a mile northeast of that. Rapid rotation on that. Okay, side. all right, Val, tell me, tell me. Okay, I see this. Some debris. Keep Val, the Valley, tell me exactly where you are right now. Okay, uh, David, we're on the hey, south side of Purcell on I-35, right off of 35 south. at a gas station. You know where I'm talking about. Here yep. and um, we've seen two spin ups in two different places. There we go. The main there part is in the back side of the wall cloud on the southwest side, and another part is at the head of the wall cloud. There's two rotations here, uh, both have to be watched. Both are just southeast on the very southeast side. Oh, there it is right there. Look, look at the motion some strong motion. Look at our shot right there. You see it right there? There's gonna be an, I think there's gonna be another tornado, David. Okay, well, hang on just a second. We're going to go back to the air, stay on the line. We'll be right back with you. Let's get a jiggy right here. I see something in Val shot. Val, go ahead. Give us an update. Okay, David, we're on the bridge right now that goes over the river. It's blocked because there's a wreck here. So any of the chasers, if you're hearing that, uh, keep that in mind. We're looking at, we just saw another spin-up, David, right underneath the wall cloud, right on our shot. As a matter of fact, there's one right now. Look, right there in the middle of our shot, right there in the middle of our shot, this thing keeps doing these small little spin-ups. There's another one over here. Another one right there. There's a tr man. This this thing is small spin-ups uh, in various places underneath the wall cloud, David. Uh, that one right there. Every time we, we see debris with the two on the ground, and that one is still on the ground. Uh, if you're looking at it right now, there's no condensation, uh, and a lot of these there's only partial condensation. Uh, but right there, there's some debris being kicked up on the ground. Back to you, David. All right, great job, Valcaster, and again, uh, he's right there That's on the ground. ground. With Alan Rosie, uh, Tom and Robber down there, uh, as well yeah. with this form. But uh, the video, again, on top of Purcell, uh, back to Lexington. If you're just now joining us, we've had uh, several, several tornadoes, maybe half a dozen small tornadoes on the ground. Uh, again, right now, it's going to be just south and east of Purcell. But if I live in Purcell, uh, I'm still in my safe spot. If, I'm in, if I live in Lexington, I'm for sure in my safe spot right now. And this thing is not moving very fast okay. at all. Okay, let's it's, go back to it. There's Jim's shot. All right, there's Jim's shot. And uh, these things just spin up. What happens is they just spin and we get a quick tornado on the ground. Uh, let's go to valve shot. Let's take valve shot quickly here, control rooms. And uh, there you go, there's a tornado. Valve for head. Okay, uh, David, this is right under the spot we were looking at before. It lifted and now it's back on the ground again. Uh, there's quite a bit of debris being picked up right now from that. Not, not a lot of condensation, so it's, it's kind of hard to see these before they come down. Uh, but that's definitely on the ground, and there's definitely damage being done. As a matter of fact, it's been on the ground now for a couple minutes. It uh, looks like to me it's kind of moving east or northeast. David? Uh, great job, Val Caster. And there it is, folks. This is what we're dealing with. These small little wispy tornadoes underneath this big body. There's one again. And uh, again, we, we, we get these from time to time. But I tell you what, these things, uh, they spin up quickly, and Val's seen it on the ground. And Jim Garner is standing from up again. Over. Oh. Here, from here, from uh, over the two freight arts. Uh, over. Oh, no. Back to north of Mingan. Uh, west of over now. This area still has. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm going at it. It is from here to the southern. You got a chain? Yeah, I got a chain. I can drag it. If you got a chain, look it up. I'll pull it. Get your favorite bridge here. Okay, I will. The atmosphere in this part of the state is more unstable on top of the metro. But we got to watch this. All right, we have to watch these storms out west. Headed towards Holbrook, Goatee Bow. Yep, Carnegie, Fort Tom, just get ready. It's coming. Severe storm. Uh, Carnegie, Fort Tom, Goatee Bow, Holbrook, Goatee Bow, Fort Tom, Carnegie, Fort Tom, Goatee Bow, Holbrook, Goatee Bow, Fort Tom, Carnegie, Fort Tom, Goat
and the potential is there to get tornadoes out of this as well. Let's drop a little farther south here, guys, quickly. Here's to this storm uh, getting stronger. We talked about oh, these. That's fine, that's fine. Southwest of Hollister. We have to watch these two cells here. Headed off to Frederick, headed off to Snyder. Locked. Again, big storms here going on. Tell me, Amanda, what do you got that? Okay, David, uh, I'm on the bridge between Lexington and Purcell. We had intense rotation over Lexington on the east side. I've got Valcaster right now trying to pull the uh, damaged vehicle off the bridge so we can get through. He's doing a heck of a job like that right now. Uh, the rotation has moved to the east, David. I don't see the rotating rain curtains, but there was very vigorous rotating rain and updraft there. I could see moisture coming up from the drain, so I'm pretty sure we had a touchdown over there somewhere just east of the bridge. Uh, probably three, three miles on the, on the Lexington side, David. All right, John, Alan Rosie again, he's on the Lexington Bridge right there. He's looking off right in here, and he had the tornado on the ground there. And uh, Val's right there with him. There's been an accident on the Lexington Bridge. And it's stop over here. Stop. And Alan are trying to uh, help get the car out of the way so we can get back and going there. Along there again. I think, uh, give us an update. Uh, what you see so far? And, David, uh, what's the what's the, what's the, hey, we go got ahead. a tornado on the ground. Zoom up on that. We got a tornado, another tornado, David. This is going to be northeast of us. We got debris on the ground. If you can see our shot, I know it's kind of grainy. Uh, that is to our northeast, probably about two miles, maybe a mile and a half, straight northeast of our location. We're going to be. That's going to be about maybe a mile and a half north of the highway and probably about, I want to say, three miles or so east of Lexington. And that is right under the main circulation right there. You can see it. Back to you, David. It is, and uh, this is what they look like, folks. We get this condensate or water vapor. Again, there it is. That, that's the tornado on the ground. Now, this is not that impressive looking, but winds in here, you know, 50, 60, maybe 80, maybe 100 miles per hour. Some of these weaker tornadoes, that are just tree huggers. I mean, these things are forming in the trees, like this one is. Again, and the low wall cloud is about 200 to 300 feet above the ground. Uh, Valley, it looks like it looks to me like it's still on the ground, but it's not very strong. Go ahead. Yeah, I think it is. Um, these things appear very, very fast, and you nailed it. They're not that strong. I mean, as tornadoes go, you know, maybe 100 mile an hour winds. I mean, that's strong enough to damage. But as far as tornadoes go, they're not, you know, super, super strong, but definitely damaging. And when these things pop down, I mean, they're right under the main circulation there, and it comes down in no time. And, and we, we even see debris on the ground, so we know there's damage being done. Uh, but there's not a lot of warning. The only warning you get is you're right under the circulation, and boom, it pops down. So, uh, okay, Doug. Yeah. Doug, real quick. Okay, yeah. You're, you're, I see you're, you are, uh, you're just a few miles east of Purcell. What direction are we looking here? What direction is that from Purcell? Right there, what's that shot? We're looking northeast, David, and we are, you know, we're probably, I'm going to zoom here, in here on the map and see how far. We're east of Lexington, looks like one, two, three, about three miles east of Lexington. And I'm going to yeah, guess right. about a mile and a half, that tornado, about a mile and a half or so north of the highway. Right, okay. All right, looks like maybe another tornado there on the right now. Looks yeah. Like another tornado on the right. Yeah, and you know, that's our location. That's probably another mile east of where we are. So I'm going to say probably four and a half miles east-northeast of Lexington. Okay, four and a half miles east-northeast of Lexington. There it is again. Another yeah. tornado. Yeah, this, one, tornado this one's a little bit... Yeah, this one's a little bit bigger as far as the condensation goes. I mean, okay. uh, the other ones didn't really do that, but uh, I don't know, this one might end up being stronger. Right. Well, I mean, the, the environment is still there. Nothing's changed. And uh, I'll tell you what, we have had a lot of very, very small. There it is again, folks. Look at this water vapor coming out of the trees. And this whole area, this is a tornado. There it is. Right there. There's the tornado on the ground. Look at that, folks. Looks like smoke. 
Uh, but that is water vapor. There's the tornado on the ground from Val. That's going to be looking east-northeast of Lexington, about four miles, and boom, there it is. It's gone.